Hi, my name is Chloe Onensen. I've been interested in design and art and drawing for quite a long time now. I've always wondered how a project that maybe I designed could actually become something that everyone else could enjoy. Lucky for me, there's this new place called Bridge Plaza that's going to be built in my hometown. WSN designed the building and they're going to give me a behind the scenes look of how it is built. Today, I'm going to talk to Mark Sipos. He's the lead architect of the project. This is the uh, Bridge Plaza project. On the lower level, the intention is to have a beautiful two-story atrium, and then to the left, possibly a bistro or a restaurant some retail spaces here. And then going up from the second floor to the fourth, there's gonna be some offices, as well as a training room here. And then on the fifth floor, it's kind of interesting, there's gonna be some residential apartments. And the warmer elements that you see um, picking up here, what we call the towers, are of a limestone from here in Mankato called Better Stone. So as we look at these, tell me a little bit about your particular interests. Well, pretty much I just really like designing like houses or like just looking at like buildings or whatever and seeing how like pretty they are and like wondering how they actually become that building, you know? Let's go see the real thing coming out of the ground then. Yeah. So some of the things we talked about earlier, Chloe, you're starting to see, such as the vertical elements, stairways, and elevators. Um, the atrium that we talked about is about where that uh, lift truck is, and on the left is the multi-tenant space that could house a bistro. As you're coming across the bridge, which you can see there, they'll start to notice that in the, uh, the atrium. And then the big entrance. Right? The grand the, entrance, yes. exactly. It'll catch your attention as soon as you're coming across there. So it's kind of a sequence as you're driving like across the bridge. How does the different types of steels, are like some of them stronger than the other? To, well, that's a things? good question. Yes, yes. Uh, there are different types, but in this case, it's all one type of steel. But the depth of the steel that, uh, that you can see the vertical distance varies. Um, and that is dependent upon the weight that that, that particular steel member is, is carrying. Another thing that you might be interested in, you see all that saran wrap over yeah. there? What do you think that's for? Take a guess. Holding a key? I don't know. You're exactly right. That's called tenting. And the idea is in winter, when it gets to certain temperatures, you need to tent uh, a structure. Mark, for your time and explaining about this beautiful project. Well, Chloe, we appreciate you coming. Uh, anytime a future architect is on site, we really enjoy it too. You're very welcome. And I look forward to uh, conversing with you in our next episode. Let's get on to the next episode.